Hello friends, welcome to Cumberland County Public Library Virtual Summer Reading Club Program. I'm Miss Debbie from West Regional Branch and let's start with our hello song. You remember it, it goes like this. Hello friends, hello friends, hello friends, it's time to say hello. Lions and tigers and snakes, oh my. Lions and tigers and snakes, oh my. They all have tails, some will scare you as well. Lions and tigers and snakes, oh my. Right now, we're gonna take a look at our map of animals. These are animals all across the world. Let's start right here in North America where you might see the bear, the bald eagle, a wolf, and an alligator. Travel down to the Pacific Ocean and you might see the orca. Here in South America, you might find the monkey, the llama, the anteater, and snakes. Let's travel to the Atlantic Ocean and find more whales. Right here in Africa, we'll find the lion, the giraffe, the rhinoceros, and zebras. Here in the Arctic Ocean, you might find the polar bear. Eurasia, which is Europe and Asia put together, you'll find the bear and a camel, an elephant, a panda, a tiger, and I think this is a crane. Let's go down into the Indian Ocean where we might find squids. And right across in Australia, there's the koala bear and the kiwi. And here in the Pacific Ocean, there's the turtle, the sea turtle. Last but not least, here in Antarctica, we'll find penguins and seals. Wow, so you have to travel the world to see all kinds of different animals. So right now, I'm going to introduce some new friends to some old friends. And I have them coming right over, right away. And I'm waiting patiently and hoping they'll show up soon so they can meet each other. And did I hear something? That's the doorbell. That'll be my first friend, my first new friend. It's my first new friend, letter C. Yes, this is letter C. And letter C makes the sound k, k, k. Yeah, this is letter C. And I want to introduce letter C to my friend, cow. Cow! Moo, moo. Hey, cow. Hello, Miss Debbie. I, I want you to meet my new friend, letter C. Oh, I know C. You do? Yes, I know C. Oh, um, my name, Cal. K -k -k -k. Cal starts with C. <gasps> Cal starts with the letter C. Wow. Well, I tell you what, Cal, why don't you and letter C go off and hang out together and find some more C words? Okay, let's go, letter C. Wow. So that was letter C, my new friend, and he got to meet my old friend, Cal. Oh, now I'm waiting for another friend to come. She'll be coming at any moment. Let's see, when will he get here? Oh, oh there's the doorbell again. Oh, it's my friend, letter S. S makes a s sound. Well, and I want to introduce my friend, new friend, letter S to my old friend, Shark. Dun, 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 dun. Hi, Shark. Hello, Miss Debbie. Um, I want to introduce you to my new friend, letter S. Oh, I know him. You, you do? Oh, yes. How? My name, Shark, starts with S. Oh, my goodness, friends. Shark starts with the letter S. Oh my goodness. Shark, can you take my new friend letter S and you guys go find some more S sounding and S spelling words, please? Okay, good job. Let's go S. Wow. 
All right, that was really cool. So let's see. I introduced my new friend, letter C, to Cal, my old friend, and I introduced my new friend, letter S, to my old friend, Shark. Whoa, just one more friend to show up. One more new friend, that is. He should be coming at any moment. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, there he is. <gasps> it's my new friend, letter B. Yep, this is letter B. And B makes the B, B, B sound. Oh, I'm so excited to introduce my new friend, letter B, to my friend, Bear. Hi, Bear. Oh, hello, Miss Debbie. How are you? I I'm fine, but I, I want to introduce you to a new friend of mine, and uh, uh, his name is Letter B. Oh, yeah, I, I, I know him. You, you do? Oh, yeah. My name, Bear, starts with a B. <gasps> uh, Bear starts with the letter B. Oh my goodness, Bear, I'm so glad to have you and, and know that you know my new friend, Letter B. Could you and, and my new friend, Letter B, go hang out and find some more B words to, to, to make up? Oh yes, that'll be lots of fun, Miss Debbie. Okay, let's go, B. Wow. So, my letter, my new letter friend, C, met my old friend, Cal, and my new letter friend, S met my old friend Shark, and finally, my new friend Letter B met my old friend Bear. Wow. Well, we've had lots of fun today and talking about animals and tales and tales. Uh, I have another friend of mine who's I want you to meet, and uh, his name is Mousy, and Mousy wants to tell you a story. Mousy, 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 come out here. Oh, there he is. There's, this is my friend, Mousy. Mousy, I, I want you to say hello to my friends. Can you say hello to my friends? Oh, come on, Mousy. Hello. Oh, my. He is kind of shy. Mousy, I, I understand you want to tell us a story. Oh, okay. And oh, 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 he wants me to interpret. Okay, so I'll interpret. So, okay, we're ready. All right. So, one day, you were walking home, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and you opened the door. Okay, okay, and you, you smelled something good. <gasps> what did you smell? Oh, you smelled cookies. Oh my God, what kind of cookies? Chocolate, chocolate chip cookies. <gasps> oh, chocolate chip cookies are my favorite cookies. So he went in and he asked his mom if he could have a cookie. And his mom said, yes, you should always ask your mom before you get a cookie. And, and, and what did you do then? Oh, then you took your cookie mm -hmm, and you put it down. Oh, okay, okay. And then you needed something to drink. <gasps> oh, oh, okay, so what did you get to drink, Mousy? Oh, a nice cold glass of milk. <gasps> milk goes perfect with cookies. So, so what did you do next? You put your cookie down and you put your milk down, and you had cookies, and you had milk, okay, okay. And what'd you do then? You took a bite of cookie, mm-hmm, and a sip of milk. Bite a cookie, and a sip of milk. Bite a cookie, 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 sip of milk. Bite oh! Then something terrible happened. Oh no, something horrific happened. Oh no, something tragic happened. What happened, little mousy? I ran out of cookie. You ran out of cookie. What did you do? You got another one? Um, did you ask your mom? There was no time. It was an emergency. Oh, okay, okay, it was an emergency. Okay, so you, you got another cookie. Mm -hmm. And what'd you do? You took a bite of cookie. Mm -hmm. and a sip of milk. Bite of cookie. Mm -hmm. and a sip of milk. Bite of cookie. Mm -hmm. Sip of milk. Bite of cookie. Sip of milk. Bite of cookie. Ah! Then something terrible happened. Oh no, something tragic happened. Oh no, something terrible that you never thought would happen. Oh no, what happened, little mousy? I ran out of milk. Oh. Okay, you ran out of milk. So what did you do? I got some more. Oh, you, you, you got some more, okay. And, and then what happened? So you had your cookie and you had your milk. Okay, so you took a bite of cookie, sip of milk, bite a cookie, sip of milk, bite a cookie, sip of milk, bite a cookie, sip of milk. Oh no! Something
something tragic happened, okay? Something terrible happened. Mm -hmm. Wait, um, little mouse, did you run out of cookie again? Yeah, and um, did you get another cookie? Uh-huh, uh-huh. And how long did this go on for? Five? Five cookies? Ten cookies? <laughs> Oh my goodness, 20 cookies is a lot of cookies for a little mouse. You know that, that, and, and what? Then you start to blow them up, and, and you did what? Okay, little mouse. You, you can't eat 20 cookies and not think to blow them up. Little mouse, little mouse, stop. We know what happened, we know what happened. Oh, okay. Um, did you tell your mommy? Okay, you told her. Did you apologize? Okay, and um, did you learn a lesson from this? <laughs> oh, you did, you did. So uh, what lesson did you, you learn? Never eat too many chocolate chip cookies! Okay, so boys and girls, don't be like little mousy. Only eat one, maybe two cookies because you could end up with a tummy ache like Little Mousy. Is that right, Little Mousy? Now we're gonna make our beaded snake craft. All you need are some pipe cleaners. You can you choose any color you'd like. I chose green. You're going to need some pony beads. If you can, the fuse beads are much better, but the pony beads will work. That's what I'm gonna use today. You need some wiggle eyes, some wiggly eyes. You need some glue, some scissors, and some felt. And I um, chose the red felt because I'm gonna make the snake's tongue. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your pipe cleaner and you're going to twirl it around at the top like so to make the head for the snake. So it looks like this, okay? Then you're going to start to place your beads on the body. Once you place, and you can place them in any order you want. You might want to do a color scheme or maybe not. Once you've placed the beads on the snake, you're going to want to cut out a little tongue like this to put on your snake, okay, from your felt. And when you're finished, this will be your finished product. You have your beaded snake, see? And there's his little tongue. I hope you enjoyed story time today, but now it's time to say goodbye. And we say goodbye like this. Goodbye friends, goodbye friends, goodbye friends, it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye friends, see you next time.